Okay. We are now recording the Mill Hill School Building Committee meeting of February uh, 9th at 6 p.m. Um, and we have four members here, um, so which creates um, what we need. Um, so we will start the meeting with the uh, Pledge of Allegiance. Mark, can you lead us in that? Hi. Yeah, Hi, sorry, I'm late. This is Norm. Hi, Norm. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? Good. How are you doing? Right. Mark? Did, did not hear that the recording has started. It, it said that on my uh it said that on my phone when I when I joined. Yeah, okay. it's recording, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay, Mark. Did, didn't, didn't hear it, sorry. Just wanted us to be in compliance. Okay, we'll start. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of, the of United. America. Okay. And to the republic Republic. for which it stands, stands. one nation, under God, God. indivisible, with liberty Liberty. and justice for all. And I apologize. I I have to defer some of the uh, long-winded stuff to other people because I've run out of oxygen. So my apologies to all. Uh, We're going to skip the meeting minutes for this, this. this particular meeting. Uh, we'll do them uh, at our next meeting. Approval of invoices. Mark, would you like to take us through the, the three major invoices? Yes, we have we have three invoices. Gil Baines, invoice number 13, dated January 31st, for $1,311,378.73. This brings... Um, this brings Gilbane up to thirty thirty almost thirty two percent complete. Uh and that you know, with the two additions going, that's basically where they are at. Uh the other one is Silver Petroselli's invoice number twenty one two fifty six dated February first. And that is for $8,478.55. And that brings them up to 26 complete of their construction administration. And then the last one is um, Walter Stapleton for the stormwater monitor. For uh, He is billing for six reports plus his uh, meeting time for a total of seven hundred dollars okay. for his invoice yes, dated oh, January thirty first. Right, three twenty five fifty six seventy one. Do I have a motion to approve? No, motion to approve. Thank you, sir. I need a second, Heather. Is it Jeremy? I'll second. Seconded. Or, or okay. Heather. Thank you. <laughs> Either one. All right. Um, comments uh, by the committee on the billing. And before we get to that, I want to make sure everybody knows uh, Dave Stein is back in the hospital. Um, and please keep him in your thoughts and prayers. Um, it's never good to go to the hospital. I can tell you from upfront personal experience. So, uh, Dave, we wish you well. Um, on the business of invoices, they are all within budget and estimate, Mark? Yes, sir. Okay. Any comments from the committee? Not hearing any. I'll hold a vote. All those in favor of approving invoices, okay, please signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Not opposed. Okay. All the ayes have it. Okay. FF, any update, Mark? Uh, this this was approved last meeting. Uh, we just wanted there was two outstanding categories 
that still needed to be resolved. They were category B and category F uh, doing uh, in conference with Fairfield Public Schools and the Mill Hill uh, principal. We decided to go with the specified products for both categories. So the total for FF&E remains the same that was approved at last, last meeting of 130,347 and 36 cents. We just wanted to give you an update that there were about 45,000 less than budgeted. Correct. Okay, good. Excellent. Committee members, any comments on that? I think that's good. That's yeah, very good. No, that's great. We we covered that last week. That's great. Okay. Uh, project update, Rob, along with your beautiful pictures, you got some beautiful words, Dad. Yep, going to give you guys a quick little summary of where we're at. Um, so out at the music edition, at this point we're starting to transition into the finishes. Um, so right now we, we're basically have all the ceiling grid in the music editions and all the rooms except for the corridor. Um, we're dropping the MEP lights, you know, the lights and the grills and diffusers for the HVAC system into the ceilings, uh, and we'll be looking to start padding those rooms out, putting the actual ceiling tile in, um, if not next week, the following week, the beginning of the following week. So getting close to uh, being able to actually put in the ceiling tile and get those rooms looking finished, um, you know, from walls up, because right now we have, we've painted the walls, so you can see what the color are. Um, we took Kevin for a little tour today, so he got to see what the music classrooms looked like with the paint on the wall. Um, the other big item uh, we're working on in music is we're starting to set the rooftop unit that gives us the HVC, the heating and the air conditioning for the space. Um, so our roofer's on site tomorrow, and we're projecting for next weekend, the 20th, that we're actually going to set the rooftop unit in place at both music and kindergarten. Um, Good. And then the last noteworthy item on the music is that we're going to start flooring next week. So between the ceilings progressing, the walls being painted, and the flooring going in, you know, by the end of the month, you kind of get a good feel for uh, what the space looks like from a finishes standpoint in a couple of the areas. Um, Excellent. Moving out hey, back yeah. to kinder, yep. So yeah, kindergarten, we're working on windows. We're finishing up the last little couple areas of brick. Um, so by the end of next week, we should be in good shape with the brick being done, and the windows will actually progress pretty quickly. And we should have windows and glass installed by the end of next week. Um, the carpenters are taping the walls, and we'll start next week to start painting that area and start putting the ceiling grid in kindergarten. So, Chase, right. pushing that to pushing that to get to the same place where we are with music, but overall looking good, with uh, you know six to eight weeks left to go before the April break. Excellent. Hey, Melanie, the brick coming out okay? They look great. They look good. Good. I was concerned, but I'm glad. Uh, Rob, there's a couple things we've learned from the last couple of schools we've done. The things that come back to bite us in the tail have been the lighting, the HVAC system, and water coming from leaking. So I need you to pay special attention to those three areas because those are the areas we continue to have problems in Hollandale. As yep. you well know. Yep, understood. Okay. So we're keeping right. an eye on that. Yep, absolutely. <clears throat> We've got to learn something from doing it so many times. Okay. Uh, by the way, I understand Jason has joined us. Are you there? I am. Thanks for that meeting. Right now. Okay. Glad to have you aboard here. And. Comments from anybody on the committee? 
Any business. Was great, it was great progress. No, thank you for, for the updates, and, and the pictures are very helpful, too. Uh, appreciate it. I think so. I absolutely right, Jeremy. I think, uh, you know, I think it's a good way of keeping abreast of everything, considering we can't be there in person. Exactly. Exactly. You know. so, so thanks, Rob. And Jason, since you're last time to, to join us, I think you get to make the German motion. <laughs> uh, on uh, behalf of Harry Ackley, I adjourn. <laughs> so I have a seconded. Okay. Fastest meeting all ever. Right. Thank you all. I appreciate <laughs> Thanks, you. Thanks, everyone. All right. Okay. Bye. Have a good night. Bye. Have a good night. Good night. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night. Good night everybody. Yep. Be good night, well, everybody. Bye bye. Bye bye now. <laughs>